Um, hmm. My mom found the uh, the casting call on the computer and uh, brought it home. And asked me to read it, and so I did. And I thought, well, this sounds like me. So she said, "Well, fill out a application. You know, maybe you can get out of some of your classes in homeschool." So I did, and uh, so we sent it in. And a couple days later, they called us and said they wanted us they wanted us to come read for them. So we went in, and uh, they said at the end of the time, they said, "Well, you read great, and we'll be calling you back." And we thought, well, they tell everybody that, so. We went home and didn't think anything else about it, and a couple more days later they called back and wanted us to come back and read again. So we went back and read, and they said, you did great, and uh, we'd like you to meet the director. So we said, well, that, that's great. And two weeks later they called us and said, "Come, we want you to come out to Austin and meet the director. So we flew out to Austin on a Monday, and I met Jeff, and he was a really nice guy, you know, and Sarah and Ty. And, uh, on a Tuesday we flew back and on Wednesday they called and said, do you want the part? And I said, well, absolutely. So now I, here I am. Neckbone is, is Ellis's sidekick. He's, a, he's the right hand man of Ellis. And when we meet Mud, Neckbone doesn't really like him. He thinks he's a little strange and we shouldn't be hanging around him. And uh, actually says, this guy's a bum, you know, well, let's go, we don't need to worry about him. And then towards the end, you know, I. Neckbone starts warming up to him and really becomes friends with him. So that's that's Neckbone. I think it's a friendship, you know, how, how two kids become friends with Mud and uh, really get to know him and learn some stuff along the way, you know. Working with Matthew McConaughey is very amazing. Uh, he's an awesome actor and he just knows how to, knows what to do and he really helps me and Ty get into character when we're working with him. He's a very, uh, what's that word? Good role model. He's a very good role model. Jeff Nichols is a great director. I mean, you know, he really knows his stuff and uh, just knows how to work with people and really great guy. He's just a really, really all around good guy. Ray McKinnon was really cool. He's you know, really go out of his way to talk to you and uh, really help me and Ty get to know each other better, actually. And uh, Michael Shannon, he's he's a really good actor. He's very funny. He has a really good personality. Uh, Reese Witherspoon is a very good actress. She's really pretty and, like I said, she's a really good actress and has a really good personality, too. Matthew McConaughey. Uh, I don't know if he really gives out pointers, but he really gets you excited on what you're doing and really gets you pumped up for the for the scene. And you know, him he himself is always pumped up for a scene. It's really funny to watch him get into character. And uh, but he really helps, you know, show you how to just do that. And you watch him, and like I said, he's a very good role model for anybody. Uh, Huckleberry Finn was really similar. <laughs> To, uh, to Mud, it you know has a lot of key parts in there that really remind you of the movie. And you know, as Jeff said, if you're gonna you know write about something, you might as well take stuff from stuff that's good. And and Huckleberry Finn is a very good book. It was a really good experience experience to read it. You know about the movie and just a good book.